In this video demonstration, we're going to look at the Star Team working folders and how we can use them within the Star Team client. We will look at how to create and modify project folders and files and update them in the Windows Explorer view. This will help explain the relationships between Windows Explorer view and the Star Team client view. We will start by creating a new project in the Star Team client. We will pick our server configuration, which we've set up in the previous video, and click Next. Next, we will enter a project name. I will call mine My First Project, and then enter a description. And then click Next. Next, we will select the destination of where we would like to store our Star Team project files. We will click to the browse and locate to the preferred location. I will create a new folder and I will call it my first working folder. Click OK and click Next. As we have created a new folder, we will not have any child folders at this stage. We can specify our child folders after we set up our project. Click Finish. Once we have finished, Star Team will generate the folder structure specified. At this stage, the root folder is empty. What we will need to do now is create our working folder and open it to add the content. To do this, right click on the root folder and create working folders. To explore the folder in the Windows Explorer view, right click on the folder and select Open Working Folder. As you can see, we can now see our working folder in Windows Explorer. Let's add some content. I'm going to add some folders and files that I've created earlier to demonstrate. I have created four folders, all self-labeled, containing text files in each folder. Let's go back to our Star Team project and press F5 to refresh. As you can see, in our folder tab, we have four folders not in view. This means that the folders have been added to the Windows Explorer, but not added into our Star Team client view. To add the folders, highlight all the folders and select Add to View. As you can see, the folders have been added to the Star Team project. They've even appeared in the tree view in the left-hand pane. Let's take a look at the contents within each of the folders. To do this, select the File tab along the middle pane. As you can see from each folder we click on, the files appear as Not in View. Same as before, we need to add these files into the Star Team to make them current. Right click on the file and select Add Files. Once all the files and folders are added, you can then view all the files together under the one pane by going to the root folder and selecting the icon All Descendants. This will list all the files contained in the child folders. Hopefully this demonstration helped you to understand the relationship between this Windows Explorer view and the Star Team client view of the working folders and files contained. Thanks for watching.